Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a very exciting edition of WW2K20 News on the Balboa Show, baby. Now, on the 16th of July, Brian Williams, a UX developer, a part of the UX team who developed WWE2K games, tweeted this. Had a great day at the office today. I basically had a six hour meeting with my co-workers discussing plans for a project that I hope becomes a reality. We played a lot of Smackdown, here comes the freaking pain today. Now what does this mean? Why is he saying this? So what exactly does this mean? Well the speculation starts here. Now back in May we got reports that from the Ukes team that a lot of them are not happy with their latest editions of WW2K. They feel restricted. You know WWE has sort of a say of what goes in the game and what's been taken out. Not just the roster members, I'm talking like game modes, uh, creations, all that kind of stuff. Like, I think they blamed uh, taking out the finisher, create a finisher out of the game. Maybe it was because so they can sell more new moves uh, via DLC. And, you know, this kind of thing is a pain. It's a real pain for WWE fans. Like, you shouldn't have to pay, like... For new moves, I mean, it's cool if it would be cool if they just added it for free, but I get it, it's a business model. But you know, taking out a very, very cool move like a uh, cool, cool game mode, sorry, like uh, create a finisher, which a lot of fans are attached to, a lot of fans love, including myself. And you know, it just like it really takes away from the experience, you know, when you want to really customize a character, when you want to like even get like new updated moves that WWE 2K themselves can't provide well there you go you can create it yourself so from this tweet it seems Brian Williams is going to be part of the Ukes team that are going to be focusing on a new WWE 2K game Vice President of Ukes Hiromi Furuta's claims in May stated that an alternative wouldn't necessarily be about chasing money or trend so this is going to be a truly uh, fan gifted I mean the the guys there actually said that we're fans of these games we're fans of wrestling game a lot of wrestlers became wrestlers because they were fans of the game for God's sake I were became a fan of professional wrestling because of the WWE game and you know it's just like I, my first kind of experience with wrestling was through the games and that's what really got me hooked you know watching the tv so it's really important that these games succeed and you know these guys are fans these this new this team within the ukes team are fans and they really want to create a game that fans will be so happy and so excited to play and just something that is really unique i mean two WWE 2k games that would be absolutely insane now, i don't think the second game will be releasing every single year which is absolutely fine take your time take three years at a time if you need to i just hope this is a very fun game what he also could be referring to is a plan to remaster here comes the pain now i don't know about this i mean you can't if you remaster a game like that i mean all those old superstars i mean you can't really put them in the game I don't think you I don't think they have would have permission to do that. I'm not really sure. Maybe remaster it and you know update the graphics and update the roster members which would be cool. Uh or have like I'm sure they will have a lot of old wrestlers, the ones that they can actually use, like Shawn Michaels, Super H, all that kind of good stuff. And then just add the rest with our current WWE roster. It could be an arcadey game which really just is focused on fun arcadey you know gameplay rather than simulation which a lot of these WWE 2k games aim for nowadays but yeah an alternative like that would be absolutely incredible so there's your confirmation there's your proof that something is in the works but i am so excited to see what more news we can get on this i'm sorry that i was a little bit late on this but i really wanted to give my thoughts guys thank you so much it seems like WWE2K20 is coming October 9th thanks to the base.com leak. You can go ahead and watch that video. Link in the description in the corner. It's just my previous video. But if you're watching this in the future, well, I'm from the past, baby. But yeah, guys, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. I love every single one of you. Thank you for 14.8 thousand subscribers and for you know 1.8 million views altogether on this channel. God bless every single one of you. Peace out, and I hope to see you next video.